Hi everyone. Our focus persists on the evolving situation surrounding a potential cyclone that could take shape to the north of Reunion and Mauritius over the upcoming weekend. Staying up to date of these weather developments is crucial, and you can stay informed by liking and subscribing. This ensures that you receive timely notifications whenever a tropical update is released. In our previous update yesterday, we discussed the likelihood of a cyclone forming just north of the region. While this system looks likely to develop, the exact intensity of the cyclone remains uncertain. The most recent model run from the GFS indicates the rapid formation of an area of thunderstorms that warrants close observation. However, a distinctive characteristic observed in the forecast model is the broad presentation of the system. This broadness implies a lack of compactness or small-scale structure, which is not typical for a well-formed tropical cyclone. This feature introduces an element of uncertainty, suggesting that if the system does develop, it might be weaker than anticipated in the forecast models. Nevertheless, it's important to note that such dynamics can undergo changes. Factors that work against the development of this system include its broad presentation, potentially slowing down its development. On the other hand, aiding its development are the notably above average sea surface temperatures and relatively low wind shear. These favorable conditions will assist in the continuous buildup of strong thunderstorms, contributing to the system's potential development. At this time, it is reasonable to think that there exists a threat of a potential cyclone forming just north of Reunion, Mauritius, and possibly Rodriguez. However, predicting its exact strength or precise trajectory is currently not possible with the limited information regarding this area. The most probable scenario at this stage suggests that a tropical entity will likely track south toward the islands. This means, it is highly recommended for the islands to closely monitor the situation. To be the first of receiving these updates, consider subscribing with notifications enabled. This not only ensures that you stay informed, but also extends this valuable information to others who may benefit from it. Your support is appreciated, and it helps in keeping everyone safe and well informed. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, stay safe.